Hi, this is Joachim for statisticsglobe.com and in this video I will show you how to overlay a histogram with a fitted density curve in the R programming language. So in the video I'm going to show you two examples and both of these examples are based on the data frame that we can create with lines 2 and 3 of the code. So if you run these two lines of code you will see that at the top right of RStudio a new data frame object appears. And we can also have a look at the structure of this data frame by running line 4 of the code. And now you can see at the bottom in the RStudio console that our data frame simply contains one variable which is called x. And this variable is consisting of numeric values. Now in the first example of this video I will show you how to draw a histogram with fitted density curve based on the basic installation of the R programming language. And the basic installation of the R programming language contains the hist function that you can see in line 7 of the code. So if you run line 7 of the code, you will see that at the bottom right of RStudio a new histogram is created, which is showing our data. Now what you also can see is that within the histogram function we have specified the prop argument to be equal to true. And this means that our histogram is shown based on probabilities instead of the count of each number. And this specification is important if we want to draw a density because the density is also based on the probabilities. Now if we want to add a density to this histogram then we can apply the code that you can see in line 8. And in this line of code we are using a combination of the lines and the density functions and within the density function I'm simply specifying the values for which I want to draw a density and I'm also specifying that I want to show my density in a red color. So if you run line 8 of the code you will see at the bottom right of RStudio that our plot is updated and now it is showing the histogram plus a fitted density curve. So this is basically how to draw a histogram with a fitted density curve in the basic installation of the R programming language. However, the R programming language provides many add-on packages which are able to create even prettier plots. And one of these packages is the ggplot2 package that I want to show you in the second example. So if you want to use the functions of the ggplot2 package, you need to install and load the ggplot2 package as you can see in lines 11 and 12 of the code. I have installed the package already so I'm just going to load it with line 12 of the code. And then we are able to use the ggplot function in combination with the geom histogram function and the geom density function. So line 15 of the code is specifying that we are drawing a histogram and line 16 of the code is specifying that we are also drawing a density. So if you run all these lines together, you will see that at the bottom right of RStudio a new plot is created and this plot is again showing a histogram and a fitted kernel density curve. So in this video I have shown you two examples how to overlay a histogram with a fitted density curve in the R programming language. However, in case you want to learn more on this topic, you could check out my homepage statisticsglobe.com because on the homepage I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the content of this video in some more detail. And I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video so you can check it out there. Furthermore, if you have liked the video, I would be very happy if you leave me a comment and make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notifications in future when I'm releasing new videos to the channel. That's it for this video. Thanks a lot. Bye bye.